Hello everyone, welcome to Embracing Nitrous. This is going to be the weekly love reading for the sign of Aries. Hope everyone is doing well. Thank you to everyone that's like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Thank you to anyone that has purchased the reading or donated to my page. I appreciate you. Anyone needs a personal reading, the information's in the box below. The energy here could be masculine or feminine, could be about yourself, the person you're thinking of, or your cross watcher. Cross watchers, if you stumble across this video and do not have Aries in your chart or anyone with Aries in theirs, uh, know that Spirit has a message for you. Okay? Let's get into the cards and see what's going on. So you want to just take what resonates, leave what does not. I've already shuffled the cards. I'm just going to shuffle a tad bit here. Release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. So some of you could be uh, thinking about releasing someone from your life. Um, because you have an attraction for someone else. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Um, and then I have engagement and honeymoon bliss here. Your love life is descending to... A higher level of commitment and enjoy the bliss of holiday time together that's for someone it looks like two different collectives here could be some of you could be releasing your ex okay could have an attraction to someone else um, Or some of you uh, could need to release your ex and are not doing so because of the attraction and you will elevate to uh, an engagement. Take that how it resonates. Can go either way here from based on the way the cards came out. These cards are tell me you know basically who I'm looking at though Aries okay gossip rivals posse spirit of uh, stone being stagnant stuck someone someone's family or someone's friends are talking about them or someone's partner is talking about uh, their relationship to someone else um, crossroads Okay. I have test offer. There's going to be some sort of test for someone here. Some sort of offer. Some sort of temptation. You could be at a crossroads about something that you find to be a temptation. Something happened in the winter that you're reflecting over for some of you. Um, you're unclear on what to do because you are being controlled by someone's black magic. Control, empty, submissive. This is my black magic card. Spells. Okay. So, yeah, you're coming out of a fog, it seems. And you're trying to figure out what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, someone's coming out of a manipulative time here. Someone was being manipulated. Um, there would be some things going on here. Um, someone around you, you may be attracted to. Or attracted to. Um, you may see this person as a temptation um, because of you being in the situation that you're in. The Spirit is telling you to release your ex and move forward for some of you. Because you have a void in your life without whatever person you are thinking of. The person may be feeling scorned because you might have did them dirty for someone else. 
disillusioned. You were disillusioned at this time. Well, the person that you did dirty could have been disillusioned on the situation and thinking things were one way when they really were another with you, okay? Um, dependent. Um, this could have something to do with a new child. This could have something to do with an existing child. Or this can have something to do with you two being codependent upon a relationship, okay? Someone's depending dependent on the other for something financially maybe uh sexually uh mentally okay someone was unavailable um self indulgent just cared about themselves and no one else misguided and someone had a whole lot of excuses to try and rationalize why they were moving the way they, they were moving, okay? And someone is saying, I don't got no time for your excuses because someone is walking away, all right? Someone said, nope, I don't have time for your excuses because I got somewhere to be. Anyway, Aries, this has been your message for the week um just remember this energy could be masculine or feminine could be um you your person or your cross watcher okay so take what resonates leave what doesn't this is either for you or for them you guys have a good week bye